Rob here from Live the Boat. We're still at the Seattle Boat Show and the boat behind me here is the 26 foot Makaira. This boat is an absolute beast. It's got a 5 16 inch hull on it, all aluminum, and uh, you can see the flare on the bow of this boat. Um, just a, a big Carolina flare here. This boat, it kind of resembles a little miniature Viking. Uh, powered with 300 horsepower, Mercury. We know how economical and how much torque these have as well. Uh, this boat will get up and scoot. Let's climb aboard, take a look around. First thing you'll notice on the back deck here is this nice decking material that really warms up this aluminum boat. And they say that there's no dissimilar metals on these Makairas, which is the first thing that corrodes out an aluminum boat. Live bait tank here, nice bait table. This is removable too, by the way. This comes out, um, it's got a fish box here in the deck and a little shower station here. If you end up doing some diving or something, you can go ahead and rinse off. It's got a 40 gallon freshwater tank, nice bulkhead here. This door closes, this window goes up and this stern steering station is attached separately to the Mercury kicker motor. So for trolling, this is a really nice setup here. It's not tied into the main at all. Rocket launchers above, got a grab rail here. Let's move on into the cabin on this Makaira 26. First thing you'll notice, this nice big sink here, nice working surface on top of it. Little oven here, pretty handy. And all the drawers are aluminum. And again, uh, aluminum plastic, even these knobs are aluminum, which really reduces the corrosion here. Nice table, of course, padded seating. And this table presses down and a, and a pad goes in here as well. So this turns into a lounger or a bench seat. And again, really warm in here uh, with all the decking material. Moving on over to the helm area, bolster style seat, good for leaning. Great visibility too up here from the helm station. Or sit down here, nice foot pad. Stainless steel wheel, steering knob, got your VHF radio, bow thruster, zip wake system, which is nice. Garmin screen here, vessel view, all your switches, and then your Mercury DTS controls right down below here. Great visibility from the helm station here. You'll notice the one piece windshield in this Makaira and it's a curved windshield, which really helps blow the water off when you're running. And you'll notice the great headliner material everywhere. Everything's either covered in headliner material with a vinyl finish or carpet, which warms up the interior of this 26 Makaira. Got your refrigerator right over here under this padded seat. It's additional storage here under the deck. And you can see the 5 16 stringers here. Look at these beefy stringers and, uh, and the bottom here. It really highlights how well built this boat is. And the welding is impeccable. You can see the beads here. Uh, they do a great job putting these boats together. And then moving on into the bow here. Padded seating up here. Got your marine head right up in here. And then if you pull this pad across, this turns into a bunk up here. Everything's carpeted out. Big shelves here on the side. Put all your belongings in here below the dash. We've got this big open area. We all know how nice it is to have a big open area like this to work at your smart craft system in here and your marine electronics. Really nice open area here and a nice place to work. These Makairas are built in New Zealand and this is the first one here in the US. It's at Tom and Jerry's Marine up in North Puget Sound. I'm gonna wander on up to the bow here. They've got a recessed anchor locker with the anchor drum in it up there and it really opens up the visibility on the bow. We're up here on the bow of the 26 Makaira and I really like this recessed anchor locker here. Got your anchor drum right down below the deck here. Got all your chain, your anchor road wound up here and it's nice because it's not right in your way when you're trying to look out the windshield. That's the 26 Makaira. A lot of craftsmanship goes into these boats. You can tell by the welds and how well put together they are. These guys know how to build a boat. They come out of New Zealand. This is the first one of its kind here in the US. They bring these into Tom and Jerry's Marine here in Washington. Thanks for watching this week. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button right down below there. We'll catch you next week.